My wife and I uh, joined this community two years ago, just before most of the day, and we've always been made most welcome. And our first uh, party, as it were, was at the Christmas party of uh, 2021, and we met an awful lot of very nice people uh, living up and down the street. And while we were sitting around chatting, a topic started to emerge that this area here, a bit about its history uh, and the fact that it used to be almost just gravel and uh, the neighbours decided that they wanted the council to put the sandstones around it and it became what you see it is today, uh, a very pleasant grassed area. And then I was introduced to Isabel and uh, given some history of hers. Uh, that she used to uh, live in the family house, which was built here, I believe, uh, in number 63. Um, and is now, she lives in number 65. And she's lived here all her life, walked up and down the hills carrying water, I believe, at one time or another, if I remember the story yes, correctly. Yes, from the spring. Yes. And now it's the garbage <laughs> down the driveway. <laughs> So uh, there seemed to be a murmur uh, around the party that perhaps we should do something about naming this area. And, and that was about it. That was the Christmas in 2021. Uh, and then the next Christmas in 2022, the subject seemed to bubble to the surface a little bit more strongly. And uh, Patsy, I think, asked uh, everybody that was uh, there whether we should uh, call it Isabel's Park or Isabel's Reserve. And the vote at the time, I think, was almost unanimous uh, that it will be Isabel's Reserve. Cut a long story short, uh, Robin, I think, was going to make some uh, uh, address to the council. Three See, times I said female. Yes, yes. Uh, to the council to ask them whether they'd like to get on board. And I heard through uh, neighbours that that wasn't forthcoming. And at the time, I was looking at Google Maps and there's a pin over Ian's house that says uh, Priest's Beach. And it's been there for as long as I've been involved or looking at this area for somewhere to buy. And while I was trying to get Google to remove it, it suddenly occurred to me that, well, maybe we could call Isabel's Reserve, Isabel's Reserve on Google Maps. So I did that and Google promptly put it up there and I have to say that I was guilty in not knowing how ladies spell their Christian names and I spelt it with one L. <laughs> and during that time I'd been in touch with the men's shed uh, down here in Kiama and I spoke to Phil and he introduced me to Steve uh, and they agreed if I gave them the measurements and uh, a photograph of what I had in mind that they could produce something like this. <laughs> so that's the start of the story and this is the end of it and we thank the men's shed for their work and uh, effort to And I'd like them all to have a drink please. Isabel's Reserve. Isabel. Isabel's Reserve. Yeah. Hey. Excitement. Well, thank you very much for this, and uh, I'm very happy to see you all here. And my son and granddaughter is here, oh, and my two granddaughters. Oh, Great granddaughters are over there, my granddaughter, and uh, my son and daughter's here. And I'm thankful that they are here to see this, but the crowd we have here is wonderful. Yes. That's, we love that's you. That's what you so call neighbours. Good neighbours. There's a cereal on that, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> and, that, and that's on the telly. <laughs> well, you've been on the telly. Oh, I've been on that three times. been on that for three times. But anyhow, we've had a very enjoyable time up on this hill when I was little. Uh, we had only three homes along here when we started out. Mum's house, the greenhouse, 
and the house right at the very end. That was the three homes. <laughs> there was a little home over here where um, the unit is.
glasses. He's Isabel. 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 You legend. We love you. Thank you. Beautiful. Oh, I'll, just, I'll just say a few words on